Hi kids, welcome to High End Cheap Tech, and we're shooting the intro tonight, uh, you know, just to give you the basics, uh, before we get the new R-Tech Bluetooth keyboard that I bought off Amazon for about 20 bucks. Now, this is my old Blue Studio, and this is a great keyboard, I could use this with my PC easily, except for... Well, a couple of things. The cap. If you hit that, there are no indicators telling you you're on cap lock or not. Uh, so, that's a primary one. And, yes, it, this thing's four years old. It's filthy. It's been covered with sawdust it's been covered with a rubbing compound you know, powdery stuff from the air just dirt dust and the general stuff you get when you sit in a garage most of the time so and of course this thing's built like a tank it sounded like this from day one I don't know if you'll be able to hear it hear all that moaning and groaning yeah, I can just imagine Chris over a tech tablet going, Oh my god, it makes a lot easy. Well, once you set it down, it does. It weighs about four pounds. Okay, I exaggerate. I would guess near to a pound and a half, though. Pretty heavy. Runs off of uh, two AAA batteries. They'll last you, they claim up to two years. I've never gone more than seven, eight months, and then I just take them off and, you know, the old ones out, toss them and put new ones in. Now, it pairs extremely easy. I'm going to show you right here. That's the Axon M phone. Let's see if we can wake it up by pairing. Oh, we're paired to it. Look at that, it's asking me for a password. Eh, I wonder if I can do it here. By God, I just got in. Holy crow. And it's got a whole bunch of buttons. And let's not worry about the Logitech. But what I am concerned about and the reason I'm getting the new Bluetooth, my other keyboard, let's get to that one right now. I'm going to just turn the Logitech off. That was kind of just showing you uh, that a, if you buy a really good Bluetooth keyboard, it'll last forever. And anything Logitech will always, pretty much, oh, shaky cam last forever now this is my current pc keyboard and it has things that obviously well if you look up in the corner there huh? yeah we got our uh, num lock button and if i was to hit caps lock very important. You can ignore that warning sound. That's just my pacemaker telling me the battery's dying. That's going to get replaced, I believe, next Tuesday. Ooh, not a good thing. A little annoying the first time you hear it, but once you know what it is. Kind of a good alarm clock. 10.32 every night. So, this also has the same problem as the Logitech. If the power was to go out here, and I still want to get on the interweb, and use some sort of PC, I could use my tablet. But in the dark, how the hell am I going to see the keyboard? The new one's going to have a keyboard. So, let's get right to the unboxing. 
on the new ones. And it's got a bunch of flashy colors and stuff. And that is where we're going with the PC here. No more plug, and it'll free up the USB port on the PC. Not that I need it, it has 8 million of them. But you never know. Let's check it out and do the intro. Good morning, folks, or afternoon, or wherever you're at. Please watch the whole video. I know the intro was pretty long, but guess what we have today? Yeah, we have the new Bluetooth keyboard. So let's magically finally deliver it. It was due between, it was out for delivery at 7 a.m. Got here at 12.28 am yeah thanks u.s postal service i live 200 yards from the post office but that's neither here nor there i will now magically open the seals on this yeah i've already opened it oh, knew that would happen i hope we'll toss that aside and we have the arc tech HV030 Universal Blacklit Bluetooth Keyboard, which we're going to totally unbox and test. But let's just check out what we get. It's light, it's slim, it's portable. And I can tell you this, it makes that Logitech I was showing you in the intro look heavy well, let's get her out of there i'm trying to do this as quickly as possible but as we all know tim ain't no good at opening stuff up but oh yeah oy vey oy vey eh. what do we get eh. we get this now we got a user man. That's it. I'm going to toss the box aside. Yeah, I got enough boxes and cardboard in here. If the house ever starts on fire, it's just going to burst into flame and kill us all. It's okay. We don't care. So, let's check out that orange man. Look at that, it's all English caps lock white. Hmm. And backlighting. Looks like it's all here. I'll read those someday. Bad. Good. Enjoy the fun from your new mate. Share your experience with an Amazon review. Actually, if I really like this, it'll get a video review. Also has it in... Oh, and this product has a two-year warranty. Pretty good. Comes in some plastic, and it absolutely weighs nothing. And so, once again, the mentally challenged or unbox challenged Tim will attempt to get the plastic off without really a weight. I guess we get a peel point on the back. Sometimes I just don't look at stuff as close as I should. Now remember, we're shooting this on the Alcatel, and hopefully the audio is fairly decent. Well, that's what you get, folks, and let's see if it'll power on. We 
Because since we got power. All right. I'll be back in a couple of minutes. Because the power light went right off. I think we're going to have to charge this puppy. We'll see. Uh -huh. I did miss out on the USB cable. I missed the uh, USB charging cable. We'll be right back uh, after I see how long it takes to charge it up. All right, folks, I'm back, and uh, we're going to look at uh, some of the features on this. I've already paired it to my uh, PC here. It paired up like in like five seconds. So, as you can see, well, you probably can't, but up there, there is a charge light on if I hit the caps lock button. It's on, and oh, yeah, we got the back lighting going. I changed it to, I don't know what color that is, blue or whatever. I have a thunderstorm come by like yesterday. Point is, it's working. It's charging. Now, I've only got a charging through the USB port on the PC because it doesn't specifically state you know, can you use a 2 amp charger or a fast charger or whatever on it? I'd rather not blow it up and overcharge it. It does come with the, I looked at the USB cable. You know, it's micro USB, which you'd expect. I know some of you, oh, in today's world. Yeah, in today's world. Screw you. It works. Now, it goes to sleep pretty quick, but as soon as you wake it up, the lights come back on. So, I'm going to turn off the caps lock. The two primary reasons I bought it work. I like it. I'm going to give it, at this point, five stars over on Amazon. And uh, there'll be you know, several follow-up reviews. I might let you know in the description below. By the time I've edited all this, you know, down to where it's useful. Whether it's worth your money. Yeah, or not. Uh, and how long it took to charge up from the factory. I'm guessing it's probably going to be a pretty long time. This thing goes to sleep pretty quick, though. About two, two and a half minutes at most. But that's all right. You just hit the space bar and you're good. Mm -hmm. And uh, I'll figure out yeah, the other button, like uh, control print screen, or I'm gonna, you know, I got my volume buttons, my volume up, volume down buttons here. Uh, eh. I've got do not disturb. I've got an all. I don't know what an all button does. It may have something to do with whatever. I will find out. There's a day's wear on, and I do a follow up video. Right now, this is the initial unbox. And, uh,. As usual, read the description below. You'll find a link to this on my Amazon affiliate link. And uh, on that note, I'm going to let you go. And then edit, 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 and raise the volume on this uh, video here. Thanks for watching. And remember, subscribe, like, and hit the bell notifications so you'll always know when we have a new video coming out.